Did I say helicopter pilot? Hold on, I need to sneeze real quick. <laughs> I'm under attack. <laughs> that was pretty crazy. <laughs> happy to do anything for the ICAST Foundation. The foundation is so important, has so many good causes, and we all want to support that. It's a really unique event. It's, it's really cool that it's here at Shreveport at the Coleman's. It's, I mean, it's a perfect place to have it. We bring in some air show pilots that do some flying, and we give some rides. We thank the Coleman's for hosting this. You know, it's a pretty big job. We just come in, and we get all the glory, and we really don't do much, and they do all the work. We are in Louisiana, in the hotbed of aviation. The Shreveport, Cachetta area is all built around the locusts of talent that Marion Cole created 30, 40 years ago. Anybody that's around the air show business for very long knows that this is sort of one of our home away from homes and we're lucky enough to put on an event here for the ICAST Foundation. It is the philanthropic arm for the air show industry My name is Luke Akins, uh, 22,000 skydives, part of the Red Bull Air Force. Usually we go to air shows and we're the skydivers and we jump out and we have a good time. And all the focus is on the airplanes and all that stuff. Here you feel like you're on equal playing field with the rest of the guys. So when they talk about these superstars of aviation, I'm blown away by the people that are there. And when they try to include you in that group, it makes you feel like part of the family. And it's a unique perspective and I feel that it's changing the way that people perceive what I do for a living. Not just these crazy guys jumping out of planes, but we bring other value to the table. It's an honor to be on the board, and it's actually an honor to be here. We're surrounded by some of the greatest people on the planet, and absolutely the greatest aerobatic pilots on the planet. There's no doubt about it. The United Cast Foundation, I mean, it's an awesome cause. They have a lot of programs. There's a mentoring program. There's a family fund program. They're really there to support the industry and the performers, especially if any performers have a time in need. They're, they're right there to help them out. I'm just here to support the industry. I've been a long-time supporter of the ICAST Foundation. It's important to bring new faces and younger people into the air show business, and the Foundation is helping that happen. We had a great turnout. We had a very good program that featured a scholarship recipient, Angelina Cap, and she spent six days here with Kevin Coleman flying the Super Decathlon, the Extra 300, even got a trip in the Citation Mustang jet. My name is Angelina Cap. I'm the scholarship recipient of the Lovelace Drake Award uh, for this year, and I've been flying with Kevin for the past few days to learn more about aerobatics and get a better idea of the industry and to network with these amazing individuals. You know, that's kind of our community in a nutshell, is everybody comes together in a time of need, and that's what we're doing here. And, you know, I think we've exceeded expectations again, uh, even more so than last year. So hopefully we've raised a bunch of good money for uh, the ICAST Foundation, and we can do a bunch of great things and help our air show families that might need it in a time of need. My name's Aaron Fitzgerald. I am the helicopter pilot for Red Bull here in North America, and I get to fly this beautiful BO-105 that's behind me. I always want to support the ICAST Foundation in any way I can. This year the highlight was when Luke and I got to do our roll exit here. We've only done that a couple of times in public and we're the only two guys who do that stunt so it was fun to do it in front of such a highbrow audience, you know. You know, Lee Lauderbeck is here, Michael Goulian, Kevin Coleman, Rob Holland, all the, the big stars of aviation. I don't consider myself one of them but it's certainly fun to be shoulder to shoulder with them. We were preparing for the second annual Above the Clouds event for at least six months. And it's just been a fun, unique opportunity for people to see exactly what the air show industry is all about. This event really couldn't be put on without a tremendous executive board. Everybody just jumped in together and worked to make sure that this was a truly top shelf affair for our guests and everybody that attended and, and we raised a tremendous amount of financial support for our foundation and our programs. We're delighted that everybody could be here. It was a wonderful, great time.